balcony overthinking cause my job is What's up guys ace is here with brian and we are worth the download so this week we're going to do a mishmash i guess of a couple of reviews because last week we said we were going to or the last video not last week actually we were mm -hmm. going to review kalani's new album um but unfortunately 50 percent of the staff here got sick mm -hmm. um and so right uh, we weren't able to do a full review so we're going to give you like a 30 second review of what we thought of the album so long long album 18 tracks long to me it felt kind of like three eps mashed together so it didn't flow so hot mm -hmm. um overall score I'm going to give it a pass, 2.5, but that's as far as I'm going to go. Uh, what I can say about the album, that it was disappointing. Uh, she's really talented. I just want it a lot more and too long. Yeah, I give it a, a 1.57. <laughs> 1 okay, I can't do that math. Yeah, so exactly. So 1.57. So there you go, guys. I guess if you want it's to, terrible. if you're curious, give it a listen. But... Um, I'm not not really worth the download. Moving on. Moving on to bigger, better things. So now, Big Sean um, is our Big review Sean. for this album. Um, so what, what is the name of this of this new album? I decided. I decided. That's what it was. So we're listening to this album. And disclaimer, like for myself anyways, uh, I am a fan of Big Sean. Like my brother is a really big fan. So I've listened to enough of his music. But I hadn't actually sat down and listened to a whole album through going into this album. So take, I guess, my review with a grain of salt for that one. But, um, but nonetheless, uh, I think I listened and watched enough of his stuff to get a good feel for what Big Sean could produce and, you know, what he could really bring to the table. And I just felt like he never made it to the table with his album, <laughs> wow. I guess, so to speak. So, yeah. I don't know. How did you feel about it? Well, like, you know, me being the fan and, like, you know, going back, you know, in his, old, his younger days, right, listening to him at, in his mixtape and all that stuff. Big fan, that's what I'm trying to say. I was quite disappointed because I, I, to me, I say that Big Sean is actually underrated. Mm -hmm. I think his, I think he's a like he's a well art like well performed artist. I think he his lyricism is like on top, like on on key. But it just because of the I guess I don't know maybe Hollywood or whatever he had to go through and like this album it didn't really show like you know Big Sean it, like it was a Big Sean album but it didn't really show like very like punchy very like hit. I can't say this is actually like. You know, I hit like the whole album in particular. Did they make a lot of sales? I don't know, but it's definitely not going to make a lot of sales in my book. Yeah, I know exactly what you're what you're saying. I mean, listening through to this whole album, um, it was like a super long album, but it was uh, like 14 tracks or something like that. Yeah. Um, yeah. And like throughout the album, there wasn't like one track that stood out to me. Nothing that you know kind of hit me in the face of like you know this is a bomb track. Mm -hmm. Nothing like that at all. Like uh, there's maybe two tracks that I liked okay, uh, but nothing that I was like this track's gonna stay on my phone. You know, uh, for the next foreseeable future. I don't have any of those tracks. And there's even that random feature with uh, with Eminem on it that I wasn't even sure it was M. Like it sounded like him, but his voice sounded really weird and distorted within the track. And so I was like, is this M or somebody trying to sound like M? Mm -hmm. And then I went to go look at him like, it is M, but it doesn't sound like M. And even his performance kind of fell flat, I think. Like, I don't know. I don't know. That song did it, it just didn't make sense to me. Like, you have Big Sean, and he did an all right job, and you have Eminem that did, like, something, I guess he threw a big curveball and. It wasn't like it didn't it didn't come through like it was weird. I don't know like if Eminem decided to make an album in the future, I'm not excited now just because of that. <laughs> if that's the way his flow's gonna go, yeah, because yeah. you definitely expect some really big stuff for them. You know, every time he features on something, usually it's like you know it's a it's a track, mm -hmm. and this was just wasn't. It kind of like it's it kind of just I guess was a good summary of the whole album, which was it kind of just fell flat. Like it just didn't perform to the level that you would kind of expect. Mm -hmm. And those two tracks that I mentioned that I thought were okay were probably the ones where you see some, you know, some reminiscence of like the lyricism that, you know, Big Sean can really bring to the mm -hmm. table. But you just, you didn't get that throughout mm -hmm. the whole album. I, I thought the singles are all right. I think the singles like that, that was by far maybe their best, like or in the album, the best uh, tracks. Yeah. But uh, yeah, man, didn't deliver it to the table. I don't know what else you want me to say. And I'm the fan, you know, is it yeah. worth the download? Um, so in my opinion, I'm going to give it the same score as Kalani's album, to be honest. I'm going to give it a pass, a 2.5, just because. But uh, but like I said, nothing that really stood out to me or like, you know, it's nothing I can, no wow factor for me, for sure. You still didn't answer the question. Is it worth the download? Oh, so 2.5, I guess it makes it uh, worth the listen, but not worth the download. <laughs> not worth the download. Yeah. I am, I'm in the same books. I give it a pass, like a 3 out of 5, only because I'm the fan. And I, you know, I, I definitely want the fans to actually take check out his album, right? But you're gonna you're gonna find yourself looking at the older tracks versus like in the in the previous albums versus this one in particular. It's not worth the download. I actually deleted it off my phone. Already deleted. Already deleted. Well, there you go, guys. So uh, going into next week, uh, next review, we're gonna be reviewing a Canadian band, which is 
fun for us because we're obviously we're Canadian. Yeah. And so we'll be reviewing Mother Mother. Um, this is probably I can't remember if this is like their fourth album that they've released, but in another case, the, the current single that's out, if you guys are curious already, is called The Drugs. Um, and so I don't know we're pretty ex- <laughs> excited for this album. At least I am, because um, I'm always I always have fun listening to some rock albums. So it's rock. It is rock. And so, it's Canadian. So make sure you guys subscribe so you guys know exactly when we drop that album. And uh, let us know in the comments what you guys think of the Big Sean album. Did you guys like it? Did you hate it? Did you read it? Let us know, and uh, I guess we'll catch you guys in the next one.